Yeah, school board, the district facing a $94 million deficit. They feel that they need to free up, again, the, this money, this availability by going forward with more than 430 layoffs. We did speak with the head of the teachers union who had this to say. These layoffs are not necessary. We cannot afford as a district to be cutting positions when we should be looking at how can we make our schools as strong as possible. So that's Kyle Weinberg, teacher and president of the Teachers Union. Of the more than 430 positions highlighted to be cut, 94 of them are teachers, 21 central office administrators, five associate principals, one principal, as well as hundreds of other jobs. Adding complexity to the issues, the fact that COVID relief funds, which were generally available in the past several years, have finally dried up. Weinberg says his union has proposed solutions that solve the budget crisis without the cuts, but it remains to be seen if the board will consider them. Parents we spoke to are scared of the impacts that the cuts will have, especially parents that are teachers themselves, like this woman who chose not to be identified. Well, as a mom, I'm worried that the class size will be too large and that the extra supports that we want for our kids will not be there. The school board will be meeting at 5 o'clock tonight. Eric Inetta, 